More than 500 million eggs were recalled this summer from two egg farms like this one that were linked to 1,600 cases of salmonella poisoning. The truth, the whole truth, nothing but the truth in the matter pending before this committee. The owners of the egg farms went before a house panel that's investigating the outbreak, but not all were cooperating. I respect, respectfully decline to answer the question based on the protection afforded me under the Fifth Amendment of the Constitution. The owner of the other farm was remorseful. We were horrified to learn that our eggs may have made people sick. We apologize to everyone who may have been sickened by eating our eggs. But DeCoster's son sought to blame a supplier. We view that most likely root cause of contamination to be the meat and bone meal that was an ingredient in our feed. Lawmakers, meanwhile, kept referring to appalling conditions that were uncovered by investigators. Look at the manure coming out of the building from the foundations, the door. This isn't something that just happened overnight. That manure pile is about seven to eight feet tall. Victims of the salmonella outbreak told stomach-churning stories. Some are still feeling the effects and are unhappy they didn't get a personal apology. I still have this severe diarrhea and cramping and nauseousness, and I still have trouble eating certain foods. And, you know, like I said, I've lost 30 pounds from this, and it's changed my whole entire life. Throughout the hearing, lawmakers stressed the need for new food safety legislation. The House passed a bill a year ago. The matter is now languishing in the Senate. Gary Bodlander, The Associated Press, Capitol Hill.